Grandma, Granny. You used to throw scriptures at us. Having us believe that every insult pitched from your tongue was deserving. Those verses became a crutch to disrespect others to make you seem right. But respect disabled me to speak. So I will drink the glass of tears from your children. Your grandchildren. Let the wetness touch my soul and I function in the silence button of my vocal box. Proverbs 16.31 says, A gray head is a crown of glory. It is found in the way of righteousness. But your tent of gray was deceiving. You see, when I tried to reconnect the broken branches that linked you and my mother on our family tree, you fried me. Home cooked lies and bribes in your skillet, told me I was going to want to see that my mother had planted. Join me. Pick the right side. Kiss me like a modern day Judas. I began to bloom thorns, nailing me to your wooden exterior, and I bled rose petals that dripped off your weeping willow branches. Now I now know why they say I was born in his image. Was it my pain of being hanged by your deceit, the sacrificial price I paid to allow our family to be freed from your bondage? Revelations 1, 14-15. His head and his hairs are white like wool, as white as snow, and his feet like unto fine brass as if they burned in a furnace. I never understood why you punish your children of brass complexion, chiseling layers of insults, hoping to sand their exterior and overlay of marble finishing. Wow. See, I was a light spectrum on our family tree, not realizing my complexion was what you wanted our family to be, pretend, pretend to be, be white. Mm. Although their Haitian dialect couldn't be silenced, you had it out suggestions of how to look the part. Paint your nose to lessen the width. Homie for a Caucasian point. Change the reacting of the chemical balance in your hair so it's straight, stringy, make it shine. Oh, Add some roots to your do. But you subtracted their confidence, burning histories from their roots. Oh, Was this how you were taught to love? Or do you only love based on your self-hate? Wow. Why couldn't you accept their beauty when you never told that you were beautiful? Scriptures were used as tools to follow while in the flesh. Why are you using the shred human tissue? Does that allow you to feel like you are the supreme spirit? Grandma, oh. granny, would you all curse me if I pray for your exile? <sighs> Proverbs 1 and 8. Listen, my son, my granddaughter, to your father's instructions, but do not forsake your mother's, your grandmother's teachings. Mm -hmm. You taught us that your teaching is the divine instruction of God, but even the devil can, can quote, quote scriptures. Mm -hmm. <laughs>